90% of my time with these dogs is actually spent behind the scenes, in the backyard, doing the less glamorous things. Hi, I'm Jazz Whiting, and this is Prime Canine. So some of you may have seen a video that I shared recently of these puppies doing some man trailing and some bite work. Now, if you haven't, definitely go and check that out. Um, the link will be in the description or the bio or the original post, depending on what platform you use. Now, um, Pat Stewart made that video, Pat Stewart from Operant Canine. And basically we catch up a few times a week and on that particular day we both carried a camera and we filmed the whole session and he put all the footage together and it gives you a really good insight into what some of our training sessions may look like. Now I train these dogs every day and as I said I, I catch up with Pat a few times a week to do that kind of training where we need two people. So let's take a look at what else is involved in developing and raising these puppies. Trimming nails is something that I do regularly. Now, there's three puppies, and although they don't all have their rear dew claws, that's still between 54 and 60 nails that I need to trim. So it pays dividends to teach them from a young age how to accept nail trimming without conflict. In addition to that, I also have to check their teeth, their eyes, and their ears. Each dog has their own kennel, and although they're not in them 24-7, they still need to be cleaned daily. So that means picking up poop, hosing, scrubbing, and disinfecting them. Now, that's not just to reduce any smell. <laughs> hey, Brick. That's to, to make sure that ma uh, hygiene is maintained. Hey, good boy, boy. In addition to keeping the kennels clean, I also need to keep the dogs themselves clean. So that involves brushing them and washing them regularly.
One of the most important jobs that I do every day for these dogs is filling up their water buckets. So anyone who has a dog has a responsibility to look after them. Now, it's my responsibility to keep these dogs as fit and healthy as possible so that they can do the job that we're training them to do. And that way they can live a happy and healthy life. Isn't that right, Frank? Yeah, off you go, bud.